Hi Chicken Gang and friends, I've been getting tons of requests to cover QuantumScape. This is going to be a short video as it's pretty easy one to cover. QuantumScape developed the only lithium metal solid state battery. They have JB Strubble, the guy who helped build Tesla up with Elon Musk. 10 years of R&D, 200 plus patents, energy density higher than lithium ion cells, the ones Tesla are using, fast charge and the only battery that enables mass market transportation. So should you buy or not buy? No, don't be a donkey. For me to invest in any stock, I need to be comfortable with the fundamentals of the business. There are so many red flags. Don't get me wrong, if there is a technology that is better out there, I will cheer them on. The competition is healthy and coming from what I did previously, competition is necessary. Else the industry will stagnate. QuantumScape is bad. It's not as bad as Nikola, but bad. So why no? I'm going to cover the two big obvious reasons thereafter. Stay on to the end if you want. I have taught you in multiple videos this applies to any companies. The two criteria must be fulfilled before you invest. So number one, the proof of concept where the product or service works, people like it, adoption is real. Number two is the ability to scale the product or service because it is so hard to scale anything. It could be software, it could be service, it could be manufacturing, you name it, it is hard. But you know what is easy? Clicking the like button for our furry friends. I thank you so much. Has QuantumScape fulfilled the two criteria? Not even the first one. They are still sample testing all the way to 2023. If nothing goes wrong, production starts end of 2025. So for the next four years, they are going to burn through tons of cash. Oh no, 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 no. Me stay far. The next big obvious red flag is that any technology that's going to gain market share has to be cheaper and better. Fine if quantum scale's technology is better but more expensive. At least it's better, right? But it's not. This is what they claim. Tesla cells now are above 300 watt hour per kilogram. So this is false. Tesla have a very clear path towards 500 watt hour per kilogram with Maxwell technology. QuantumScape tops out at 500 watt hour per kg. So QuantumScape is not only more expensive, hard to manufacture, it is also not better. It is not better in five years too. It just blows my mind that this discussion is even on the table. These are the two main red flags. I'll cover the small ones quickly. I don't want to waste your time. The 300 mile range, fast charge and the cost, all these claims Tesla has achieved. Next year, the $25,000 Tesla EV will be unveiled. For battery lifetime, you notice that they didn't mention any charge cycles because solid state batteries have very, very poor charge cycles. Charge cycles are the key to robo taxis. Lower cost, this is donkeys. Lower cost versus other solid state technology and not Tesla's technology. Look, no mention of charge cycles again. Oh my God, look at this BS. Revenue growth is higher than Tesla. Of course, year 27, production zero, and year 28, production starts. Any donkey can hit 101%. I mean, what? Look at this. Showing Tesla is expensive and QuantumScape is cheap. Of course, QuantumScape is cheap. Piece of third. Wrapping up, there is a reason why Tesla skipped the acquisition of QuantumScape. Look, stock price may shoot up over the short term. I've seen stories like this a million times. One day, the company is going to blow up. I told you Nikola is going to blow up. Well, I told you so. I know I'm going to get quite a lot of hate for this, but I'd rather say it. I think Neo is going to blow up if not for government intervention. For QuantumScape, they need to show me fulfillment of the two criteria before I seriously look into the company. I don't buy into an amazing sales pitch beaten so many times. I hope by sharing my thought process, hopefully you don't make these mistakes. Appreciate the thumbs up, invest safe, and don't be a...